SpaceX is often described through one analogy, throwing a pencil off the Empire State Building and landing it upright on a shoebox. So let's get some pencils. The only problem is the pencils came pretty sharpened, so I decided to do something about it. Now that they're flat, I should be able to begin 3D modeling. This model will provide ample surface area for landing. Nice, only 18 minutes. Now that the pencil's in, it's working from relatively small heights. I can work on adding a parachute. No, I know SpaceX doesn't use parachutes, but I can't really fit a rocket into a pencil. I'm gonna drop it from about six foot. And it landed. Huh. And off the Empire State Building. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't actually throw it off the Empire State Building. Yeah, I know. I don't live in New York. It's also illegal, so I don't really want to do that. I don't know if that counts. Alright, take two. It's a little too windy for the parachute, so what if we make it a streamer? All it technically needs to do is land upright, which is a streamer's job. And the little circle does the rest. Alright, try this again. Hey! It landed! Nice. But the wind blew it over. It's random, but we'll try it. Nice. Holy crap. And I think it still lands in this metal rain. But how does it work? The streamer produces drag, which keeps the pencil upright as it's falling. And the bottom part, it lacks like a shock absorber and deflects it at an angle and straightens it. It is broken from the last drop, but doesn't matter anymore. 